Just the other day I turned on the computer and they had on the YouTube section under documentaries a story about the children of Bob Marley visiting Africa. The theme was African unity. That the people from one nation in Africa and the people of other nations could come together and make life better for the whole continent. The inspiration had come from Bart Marley himself. And this occasion of going to Africa was what would have been Bart Marley's 60th birthday. The joy of his reggae singing energy and the unity and the happiness of the performance was a contagion that Bob wanted to see transform the whole continent. But he also wanted a centralized theme for the unity of the people. And he chose and its leadership, especially the former emperor, Haile Selassie. When all of Africa was being colonized by the Europeans, there was one country that stood against it, refused to be colonized, Ethiopia. No, we will resist you, Ethiopia said, from the 1700s to the 1800s, all the way to the 1930s and 40s, Ethiopia, no colonies. There was a dictator in Italy, Mussolini, he didn't like the defiance of I will bomb you! And the Ethiopians withstood the bombings, the modern warfare with spears, stood against airplanes with prayers and spears. And it didn't fall. He went to the League of Nations and was laughed at. But he didn't change his mind. Man. It didn't look like the Zulu leaders, but a petite man stood against Italy. Bob Marley says the whole continent can unite.